Hello angel boys and girls and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I am Sabrina and if you are an OG subscriber, then welcome back. This is going to be a super chilled and a pretty quick video. I was basically supposed to receive these items from Little Mistress before I went on holiday to Greece. They unfortunately didn't come in time so I didn't wear them then. Because I've got the items, I just wanted to show them to you guys. So I just have two items to show you and I'm going to try them on and tell you what I think. And this is also going to be a first impression um, because it's my first time ever trying anything from Little Mistress. If you haven't heard of Little Mistress before, I think that they're quite synonymous with doing like bridal wear, occasion wear, dresses, and they have their own website but I've seen a lot of their stock on ASOS so everything looks really good quality they're a reasonable price for well we're gonna see what we get but it seems like there are slightly more but what you get is more premium quality so I'm looking forward to seeing that and I hope that I really really like the pieces and that it can be a regular place that I shop on for occasion wear these items were kindly gifted to me by little mistress so thanks very much to them Let's get inside. Oh, guys, there's the cutest little baby playing around outside. My God, she's so small. She looks like a little... She's so chubby. She looks like a little pink potato. Oh, that's really cute. It comes in, um, I think it's like your receipt, and it just has like this little mistress, this little like envelope guy, which I think is quite fancy. It's just in case you want to like return anything. Follow us on Instagram at Little Mistress UK. They also stock two other brands on their website, which is... Girls on Trend? No. Girls, oh, Girls on Form Clothing and Paper Dolls UK. I saw some of their stuff on there as well. I can't remember. I don't think I ordered anything from either of those. And like, it's that you guys know, this bag is super heavy. Like, it feels amazing quality. Wow, this looks so pretty. This is a play suit. It's in size 8. A jumpsuit, sorry. But I love navy. Like, that's my favorite blue to wear. I'm not a big light blue unless it's like pastel. I don't really like turquoise. Turquoise. Ooh. Oh my god, wow. The quality feels amazing. This is how it looks. Holy hat. That's so beautiful. It just is just like your typical jumpsuit where it goes like down to the leg it's kind of like a cigarette trouser shape and then it's just got this beautiful lace detail all around the neck and on the arms it's so intricate i want to say it's really beautiful like just holding it it feels good quality and then at the back here i just want to do these little buttons up before i show you guys that's so pretty and cute. It's kind of got like not an open back, but it's got like a small uh, slit on the back here. And then a zipper that goes all the way down. And then the cutest little detail of these Diamante buttons, which I think is super pretty. And I just feel like this is such a nice, classy item that can be worn to like a posh dinner without needing to be a dress. I really felt like I needed something like that in my wardrobe. Like... Just really something really nice and smart, but also with an element of like casual. I feel like you can dress this up and down, but it's so beautiful and I can't wait to try it on. And it looks like it'll be the right size for me. I really hope it is. I've got these short little legs, so we don't know if it's going to be too long because the legs look pretty long. But if they are, I will just get them tailored or oh, I'm just that you guys are aware so you have to keep the tag on if you want to return it this is the navy blue jumpsuit I am so happy with this I think that it is literally beautiful it fits on like a glove it's so so nice and it's just quite structured like I feel really secure in it and I just feel like I look really classy it has pockets which is amazing like it's such a plus and i think it's such a cool extra thing to have it's a fairly fancy item and then that just makes it like a little bit more cash i think it's really fashionable with this it is a little bit like it's just been folded from being in the package so it just would need to get like steamed down so that this side is kind of a little bit more up it's just falling down at the moment but the detailing of the lace is so nice like i feel really elegant wearing this and the cost of this was 70 pounds which i I think is really really reasonable and I think that you get what you pay for at the back it's really pretty the only thing I noticed was that 
I would like it to be slightly more like straight down um, so even if I pull it down like I don't know maybe if you need like a looser fit for it to be like that but it's a little bit crunched up but that doesn't really bother me um, I just think that this is so 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 pretty I'll show you guys the bottom sorry I'm not wearing high shoes to show it off because I've injured my hip so I can't be wearing high heels but basically the bottoms are so so pretty as well they are slightly too long i've just rolled them up at the very ends but not as bad as i was expecting i was expecting them to be super long and baggy at the end this is actually fine for me i really like this little jumpsuit so much it feels so nice on and i just really can't wait to wear it and I would definitely recommend it. I would also say in terms of the sizing, so the eight is perfect for me, but in one of the items I had considered ordering a six and I'm really glad that I didn't. I haven't tried the other one on yet, but any smaller than this and it wouldn't have fitted me. So it fits me like a glove, but I couldn't go any smaller than this. So just bear that in mind that it is very true to size. Yeah, it's so pretty and I love it. Let's get the second item. This one's also blue, you guys. <laughs> oh, I'm so funny. Oh, I'm so sad because basically I really wanted to wear this to the actual wedding. Although I really liked my dress and I feel like it was good at the time. I'll insert a picture here. It's in one of my Zappo hauls, which I'll link down below if you guys haven't seen. This was a little bit more fancy. Oh, wow, so pretty. Oh, it's got like tool on top of it. This also feels really heavy and the beading and detailing feels amazing i'm always skeptical about this kind of detailing because i don't know if it will last or like i think if you catch it that it will just come out i can kind of see a few strings not a lot but not ideal it's freaking beautiful it goes all the way down into this poofy tool oh my gosh it's so nice someone give me a cool event to go to so i can wear this hi someone get married okay like this month oh my god so so beautiful it's got like this crossover detailing in the front so basically like the little boobs are like ruched in and i feel like that's going to be so flattering because it makes the boobs look pretty round i don't know how to explain that nicely but i just think it's really flattering especially for people that might necessarily not be so blessed in the booby department i feel like this will be a very flattering fit and like the detailing on the sleeves is so stunning it's a mixture of beading and like these flower gems i'll try open it so i can show you what one of the flowers look like oh i would just be so paranoid about catching this or about some of the gems de-stringing um, so i think i would be like super careful and i wouldn't want to be ratchet drunk when wearing this how pretty is that flower oh my gosh guys i got this one in a size eight as well it comes with some extra gems just in case some come off it says the decorative beadwork has been hand sewn please treat this garment with extra care little mistress cannot ensure the beads are permanent oh my god it's like a princess ball gown oh my literal word guys i am in love this dress is incredible literally it's so so beautiful on it just feels so nice i feel like a princess i really really do and i honestly i'm actually flabbergasted it's so pretty like the bottom is like it's just like a princess dress literally if you look at the bottom it's so fluffy i actually feel like i'm going to a ball or like a uh, what do you call it here like graduation or a prom there we go i feel like i'm going to prom if any of you guys are going to prom or like a big event soon where you need something like this i would highly recommend little mistress they had so many options on their website and this dress has completely blown me away i think it's so 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 stunning i'm gonna double check how much it was now i think it was like 100 pounds but that is pretty much the same amount of money that i paid for my matric dance dress and i really feel like this is super beautiful and i just need somewhere to wear it i like every day i never dress like this fancy so i'm literally just thinking in my mind like where could i wear this to i definitely will need like a nice event it is a slightly more you know fancy princess kind of a gown i absolutely love it i think it's beautiful i have zero complaints i love the way it cinches you in in the waist here and this crisscross i think the top is so flattering it's got padding inside i literally love this can't recommend it enough 
I'm blown away, little mistress, I would definitely recommend you. So guys, that was everything that I recently got from Little Mistress. I absolutely love the pieces. I'm so, so happy with the quality of them. And I just really felt like a princess in both of them. For like a first impression to something, uh, my first response, it was really good. And I would definitely shop on Little Mistress again. If you did enjoy this video, don't forget it. If you did enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe, be part of the Sab fam. If you want to see more videos like this, I'm really sorry for the changing in lighting and different kind of uh, footage. If you've noticed that during the course of filming this, I broke my camera. I had previously dropped it and smashed the screen, and this time it broke and the lens, like, shut it or whatever so I had to switch to this camera and I can see that it's like readjusting the focusing and everything like that because I haven't used it in so long that it's probably not in the most ideal setting so sorry about that but thank you so much for watching this video hope you guys enjoyed it and until the next one I love you so much bye